Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I thought I'd start the vlog now because I'm starting to get organized for our engagement party and I wanted to do a vlog on it all. So I'll put all this um, in the little vlog. Feels like ages away because it's like two weeks away and I never recorded this far in advance. Um, yeah, so I got a delivery of some balloons that I ordered off Amazon. They're really cool though. They're really, really nice colors. They're like nudes and stuff like that. So I'm gonna show you them. They're downstairs. I'm so cold and so is Bobby. We're literally struggled together. Um, so yeah i will show you them and hmm, what else do i have oh yeah i'm going to like deals and stuff today with my friend for a look around for party stuff i'm gonna get a few bits so i will show you what i guess today and maybe bring you along with me hopefully if i remember <laughs> well here's guys so my first little engagement party delivery arrived today Ooh, we got um I think it's the stuff to make a balloon arch. Um, and yeah, it's so nice. The colors are gorge. I blew some of them up to see what they were like. And they're really nice. It's like gold, gray, kind of like moody browns. Really nice. And there's like smaller ones and bigger ones. Um, so yeah, that's cool. And then I also remembered that I had these um, in the press. So I might use them. They're a rose gold in them instead of one. It might kind of still go with the beigey ones. So I'll bring them just in case because they are kind of cool, the clear ones, you know. I think I have them since my birthday. I think my friend gave them. I just got my house's TV delivery. Finally. I've literally been waiting for this. Well, no, I didn't order it that long ago. But I have been shitting myself because I got an email last night saying that I owed 110 euro in shipping for it and i think it was only like 10 like in customs and it was only like 200 euro anyway so it's baffled anyway it's a dress for our engagement party i hope to god it fits us i really i've actually never worn her cv i don't think so i'm not 100 percent what size i am like of course i asked my friends and stuff for advice but it was kind of a risk whether i should go for this one or the size up and oh it's the kind of dress that i don't want to be too loose it needs to be tight but then it might be really tight because yeah, some of their stuff is. It depends on their stretch. This is two out of three, so I thought I'd go for the size down. I just don't know, because... Oh, also, as you guys know, like, I I don't even know what size I am at all anyway, because I've been kind of, like, losing weight and just getting back into the gym and stuff in the last few months, so I really don't know what size I am, but I really, really hope that this fits, and I really hope that it's nice. <laughs> I've literally been putting off wearing it so much. Anyway, sorry, I didn't even finish. Yeah, I didn't have to pay customs. <laughs> It just arrived today after I literally had a heart attack last night and I saw loads of people commenting on Hasty CB's um, Instagram like posts and stuff been like oh, oh I'm in Europe but I'm getting I'm in Europe but I'm getting charged customs and stuff like that. I'm getting charged like a hundred euro they were all saying so like it was definitely like either a scam or a mistake because it was FedEx and apparently they don't usually use FedEx so maybe it was just an issue because they've only started or something. I have no idea. This also came from America so I don't know if that was anything. But anyway, it's all good. Don't know why I'm packaging it up but I'm literally going upstairs to try it on now. Oh my god, the quality looks so beautiful. I hope it fits. <laughs> I got a medium in case anyone's wondering. It was extremely hard to get clothes by myself. That was because it was hard to get over this seam at the back, but it's really, really flattering. I really like it. I can see why they're so expensive, if you get me, but it is skin tight. There's no stretch whatsoever. Like, I'd give that a one out of three for stretch. <laughs> I don't know why they'd give it a two. It's literally stuck to my body, but I've also had, like, food not that long ago and stuff. Hopefully another two weeks in the gym, maybe do it two or three weeks, I can't remember. Um days I think we've got two weeks. Oh, oh, hopefully another little bit off my waist, it'll be easier to breathe in, but anyway. I just hope I don't bust out of it. <laughs> my boobs. They look really flat though from the side because it's so tight. So I'll probably have to wear a stick on bra. I don't know how I'm gonna managed to fit that in there but no I probably could 
but I just have to do it after I get it on because it'll add extra. I keep thinking it's like making my lower stomach look bigger, but I think it's just where the, well it's not perfectly flat anyways, but like, I think it's just where the, I don't know what the shape of this is. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to keep it now. I'm not going to bother sending it back. I'll hopefully fit into it a little bit better. At least I can get it closed and like it's always more awkward to close it yourself, so yeah. No, it's a mixture waist snatched the like corset. It has like wire bits there. <laughs> oh my god, I can't get over how much it flattens my boobs. Like not that big anyway, but and this bit's also a bit flapping open. I'd say that's meant to be a bit less like that, but it's grand. Yeah, guys, their sizes must be so small. This is a medium. I think the next size up large is the biggest they do, and they do small and extra small. Extra small must be absolutely tiny. Maybe I should try on heels with it. But here, guys, another engagement um, package just arrived. These look so much bigger in the picture. So I don't think I'll be using these. Um, I got these for going in, like, hotcakes. I don't really know. Some, like, something. Uh, I don't know what. Crap, actually. Oh, Con's mum taking brownies. I think we put them in them probably. Oh, but I also got the sewing quite traumatic. They kind of like give me like balloon vibes, you know. And I'm kind of going for like a bit of a heart theme, like mixed in, you know. I want to get some heart balloons. I saw them in deals yesterday, but like I obviously couldn't put helium in them. I didn't even think of that before. Anyway, this is to go with my white dress. They're gloves. They could be horrible. They were only two fifty though, so I thought I'd chance them. Because the house of CB ones are £39, so it's no for me. Even though I'm sure they're great quality and they would never fall down. But yeah, I think gloves are really going to make my efforts. I really hope it works out. They're very see-through though. Like they're meant to be like mesh anyway. I didn't want like white white. But I don't know if they're going to be too see-through. So I'll have to give them a go. If not, there's ones on Amazon that look quite good. But they're like probably like 15 euro. I'd say maybe a bit more. So I thought I'd try these out first. Because like I'm probably not going to wear white mesh gloves again unless it's for like hands or something then i got some bits of jewelry actually to wear um on the day i just got loads of these because i've got like um two holes in both of my ears so i love wearing like a hoop and then another little earring but i actually can't find any just simple little diamondy studs so i thought they're nice um i just got them they were so cheap actually a euro like all their Jewelry is like a euro each. I got this. I got a couple of little necklaces just because I feel like I just lose them so often. This one, of course, is backwards, so it's going to be really hard to show you without opening it. So hold on. So this one I'm obsessed with. I've got other necklaces from them, by the way, and people literally always compliment them. I was only wearing one yesterday, and my mom complimented it like three times. And um, so yeah, this is just the shape of a little heart, a little fake diamondy thing. Um, it's gold. I thought I'd go for gold because my engagement ring is gold. Um, in all my jewelry, even though my bag is like silver glitter and so are my shoes kind of well not really but i feel like you can kind of you can do whatever you want anyways but i think i'll stick to just gold jewelry i also got this nice one with a little lock and a key on it it's like one little necklace with a lock and the, the little one above it with a key on it this key hidden um i think that's really cute and then i also got a butterfly one i think this is really really nice they look so good don't they because like i literally break stuff constantly so i can't be trusted um and then i got these really cute ones actually i'm going to take these so these earrings i am literally obsessed with there's two separate ones there and um they're both butterflies so you could wear like the two in one ear you can wear like one half in one and um, they had them like done really nicely in the pick and then they also came with um a little mini butterfly that won't focus <laughs> There it is. It is the hardest thing in the world to get stuff to focus on this. And um, yeah, that's so cute. And then there's also a little star. So cute. So yeah, I think they'll be so nice. I've only got four holes in my ears, so I'll probably just wear those four because they go really nicely together. Um, what else? I've shown you all the jewellery now. Ugh, but then the butterfly goes so nice with those. So I don't know whether I should wear the heart or the butterfly. It's very tough. Anyway, we'll see how will decide on the day. <laughs> so yeah, I've shown you the cake stuff. Oh, all I have left is um, these like little seat belts for the dogs for in the car. They're not really related to the engagement party, but I may as well show you what I got while I'm here. Um, 
I also got the dogs some like tennis balls as well that they're obsessed with. Like mini tennis balls. And then I got some of these because I forgot that I already had some. The ones I have are a lot nicer though. It's like they're a bit more realistic. These aren't great, but they were like two euros, so fuck it. And um, so yeah, I might use them just in case they don't let me use real tea lights. I'm sure they probably will though. So we're having it in a function room. I don't even know if I've told you that yet. Guys, I'm throwing on the gloves. They do stay up well enough, not perfectly, but like, I don't know. They're very see-through though. They're not skin tight either. I don't know if I could find better. I'm not sure. I also don't like this, but then they all have to be sewn like that because like how else do you sew the fingers together? But it's just, I think because it's so see-through, it's hard to like not notice it straight away. I don't know. <laughs> At least my ring fits over. That's what I was worried about. I'm not obsessed, you know. Like, I, I that looked like I was saying it about the ring. I mean, with the gloves, I am obsessed with the ring still. <laughs> Guys, you're gonna think I'm so bloody <laughs> not well and so extra, but I got some bits for the bathroom um, at the engagement party. So me and my friend Eva went to a few places. We went to like deals and Tesco and stuff. Where else did I go? Oh yeah, I went to Ikea then with my dad. Um, <clears throat> but these are from Amazon. So these are like a Euro pair hotel slippers on Amazon. So I got them for the women's bathrooms. Um, I've shown you these. These I got in Ikea. I wanted the orange scented ones, but they didn't really have them. Um, then I got just some crisps and dip for at the party. Um, there's some dip and what else have I shown you? I got some jellies at the party as well. They are gone so hard. What the fuck? Um, what else? I got mints also for the bathrooms. I got deodorant. Um, impulse. I love that reminds me. I've just been young, just brings up memories. I got some deodorant for the men's bathrooms. <laughs> I'm actually not well. I also got mint for the men's bathrooms as well. Um, and then I got chewing gum for both the bathrooms as well. And hair bands. Hair bobbins. Um, yeah, I think that's all I've got to show you at the moment. So yeah, I've always got the slippers for people whose feet are so tired from wearing their heels and they are too tired to dance or whatever, there's nothing worse. Having a pair of slippers like this for your uh, was just a game changer. I actually might just get them and bring them out in my bag when I go out, to be honest, because they're so small. Um, oh, it would just be heaven. So, yeah, I got just some of them. Not everyone will be wearing heels. Um, yeah, but I saw a lot of people do that at their wedding and also have like toiletries and stuff in the wedding. I'm gonna get other toiletries too. That's just what I got in deals. Um, I think I've got more already upstairs. Um, that I must show you but yeah I just decided why not <laughs> it's basically like a mini wedding hey guys I'm just out of the dentist even though it looks nice and bright it's actually a miserable 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 raining day once again hey rude and um, it looks nice earlier I haven't got any exercise on today either so I feel a bit I want to get out anyway hopefully it will stop again because yesterday there was a good few oh sorry there's a good few nice hours in between um the rain so fingers crossed that will happen today i'm actually pretty hungry i'm gonna go back to my mom's now i dropped the dogs there before i went to the dentist my teeth feel so clean and white i was using my um crest whitening strips the last few days and they really do work they're really really nice um so yeah that is done i'm so good like i feel so good to have clean teeth i just got a, a checkup and clean oh my god i've never seen weather like this in my whole life it is absolutely atrocious i just got out from getting my hair color matched i'm getting extensions on friday and i cannot wait i'm just getting a few just like a volume booster kind of um so yeah i'm very excited about that i'm going to lose your brown hair i've gone to her before and um, for my extensions i really really liked it Hello guys, I'm in a massive rush, so I'll catch you after, but I'm getting my extensions put in. Before. 
I ended up being a few minutes early then after all the rush that I thought I was in. I'm just trying to show you my hair before. It's actually quite long, so I'm only really getting a small amount for a bit of volume. But anyway, I'll talk you through it a bit more in detail afterwards. Oh, my hair just is not nice at the moment. I need the colour done as well. I'm getting it done next week, so kind of wait. We're Megan's now. We just recorded the pod and yeah, I didn't actually show you my hair, I don't think. Or maybe I did. Who knows? But it's so nice. Um, I'm delighted and yeah we're getting ready now quickly to go out and take some pictures because the day has run away with us. So guys it's now Wednesday so I'm finally getting my hair and nails done tomorrow. Look at the state of my nails. They're so chipped. I don't know if you can even see my hair. I've got my extensions in actually. I don't know if I showed you them properly but this is them. I haven't like straightened them or done anything with them so they're pretty good. Kind of wait to get my hair done. My roots are terrible. The last time I got my hair done was before Christmas, me and Tom weren't even engaged, and we were only talking about engagement the whole time. Me and um, my friend Aoife, who is my best friend, but also Connie's sister, were getting our nails, no, we were getting our hair done. And um, it's probably like the week before Christmas, we literally just got honey, because uh, I remember honey was terrified, because she comes to our house to do my hair, and um, she comes to our house. And um, yeah, it just feels like so long ago. But yeah, she was like, saying to Eva, oh, do you think he'll like ask you for advice on the ring and everything? Um, and Eva was like, well, I hope he would. And he already had <laughs> by that stage. So she said she was struggling to keep it quiet. Um, and Con said when he came home, we were also talking about engagements. Don't even remember that, but um, he was like, oh. Um, so anyway, yeah, she's gonna be like, what? <laughs> it happened. Um, so yeah. That's pretty much that. I'm also going to show you my shoes and bag because I got these. My friend's boyfriend lives up north, so anywhere that charges a fortune, which I'm pretty sure Lindsay's shoes was like 20 euro for delivery or maybe more. Something ridiculous. I made customs on top, so I ordered these shoes to my friend's boyfriend, which is so handy, and it was like nothing like three euro, and like reasonable for delivery. I'm so obsessed with these. I couldn't decide which colour to get because I wanted every single colour but I thought these or else a different champagne kind of colour would go best with my dress. Um, so yeah I went for pink for something a bit different because I've already got like perspex kind of ones not far off these so I wanted something a bit different. So yeah these are them. They're um, obviously a dupe of the match and match ones if I pronounced that right which I'm obsessed with at the moment, but I don't really want to spend the money on. So um, here they are, they're so nice, they're from Lindsay. I think they were like 40-ish euro. And then I got a bag as well. I remember I'm wearing my white dress, which I actually really need to steam. I'll do that later or else tomorrow. Oh, my nails are at that stage now where they're like making my teeth hurt because I don't like touching stuff with them because they're just, they feel really weak and broken, you know, that kind of way, like they're, it's all chipped off, so it's just feel weak. Um, and yeah, then I got this bag. I love it so much. It's from Ego. They have such nice stuff. I literally wanted everything, so I'm going to have to do another order of other stuff um, in a while. But this is stunning. So this is obviously from Ego, but it looks literally the image of the Balenciaga Airglass bag. So I'm absolutely obsessed. The only thing is I wish that it went underneath as well that wasn't just white but probably only me will notice that. And I also was kind of like how is it going to be glitter? Like will it be horrible to touch? Will it come off all the time? But they're kind of just like mini diamantes and then it's like the glitter effect from far away pretty much. So yeah, I'm absolutely obsessed with that. The shape of it is perfect. My phone will perfectly fit as well. Insane. Um, yeah, the quality is absolutely amazing and it also comes with a little silver strap in here which is very heavy as well so want that in different colors to be honest but um yeah i think that was like 40 euro so gorge so happy with those i'll show you them properly when my whole life fits together anyways the <laughs> baking i don't care about the location all that matters not a me that you wherever I go, baby I just need you by my side Yeah That's until the day I die Ever since you found me 
We the only thing I see Forever and a day is you and me And they can't replicate this unity No pressure I can see I'm watching and they try to do better But you one in a million, you ain't average Girl, I promise I'ma have you living lavish Take a trip, girl, we're about to vanish Cause I'll go anywhere Anywhere Just as long as you with me Cause girl, I know that you get me So I'll go anywhere About the way they're looking at us Cause I know they wish they had it And they know we doing damage to the game I don't care about the stereotype I can never do it, mine on we the stereotype I'm talking left, right, link I'm talking left hand ring I'm talking this right here forever We ain't here just for the summer Always on 10, we ain't never had to come up Young right now, but we gon' watch the numbers run up Honestly, I love the way you carry it It was an easy decision, I had to marry it Honeymoon, I'ma put you on a chariot And they don't make them like you no more No pressure Guys, I just got my color done. Woohoo. I'm really happy with it. I just styled it myself. The girl comes to my hair. Comes to my hair. The girl comes to my hair. She comes to my house um, to do it. So Eva's downstairs. She got hers done too. Hers is really nice. Haven't seen it properly yet though because I don't think she's properly dried it yet. But so it's literally curled in the end. I'm going to be washing it again on Saturday anyways. Today's Thursday. Um, so yeah, we started baking as well. I took lots of vids for you guys. Started making the cookies. Sorry, I haven't rolled this in properly. It's driving me mad. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go down to with my hair. Got two shades of blonde and a low light in it. And like a big chunk of blonde at the front. So it's a bit blonde at the front. Um, and I'm contemplating cutting my bangs a bit shorter. I don't, she kind of just trimmed them and gave me a fringe at the front. And I forgot to ask her to cut them shorter. Um, so I'm thinking I might do that. But anyway, I'm really happy with it. I also got my nails done. So I got them this really nice pink colour. I didn't think it would be this pink when I saw it. Um, on the bottle, but I like it. I wanted it to be like kind of see-through because I want to get hearts in it. And then I panicked because when I booked in, I didn't ask them to do any design. And then there was like people coming in after me and all. So I didn't ask them to do the design. So I might attempt to draw some little white hearts on them. Hopefully I won't wreck them. But um, yeah, no, I actually really like them. They're all kind of different lengths because I really want to, I want my nails to be long, but also some of them broke. So this is my right hand, so they're particularly short, but it's still, they still look nice. I don't think you notice that they're um, all different lengths. I think it's kind of okay. But um, yeah, anyway, so I might do the hearts. I'll show you if I do them. Anyway, I'm going to go back downstairs now and finish the cookies off and then I'm going to make cupcakes tomorrow and Eva's making the cake and other cupcakes. I think she's making them later on her tour. Layers. Camper night. She's going to my toes. Bob, er, Bob Con drew hearts on my nails from yesterday. Well I got them done but then didn't have the hearts on them. So Con did them. And he did an excellent job. Should I wait for the office should you wipe it off? Should I? No, 15 minutes. No, 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 the thing I've got just slip on the foot still. Oh, uh, yeah, you can use this towel if you want. Oh, I can't really walk in this door. Oh, yeah, I'll bring it in. I'll put some clean water on it. Doing the face mask. I'm just cleansed. I'm going to use one of the two. These one, and I also have a foot peel on my feet. This is Cardi B Duo. This one's for replumps and rehydrates. One week equals, or er, one mask equals one week of serum hyaluronic acid. That's good. And we, we just started a different season of Married at First Sight Australia. So we finished, well we're up to date on Love is Blind at the moment, up to date on Pam and Tommy. So, yeah. It's tough. Hello, so it's a Friday. Um, and it's the day before, so I'm going to now make... 
now I'm gonna make, well I'm gonna try to make um, these cupcakes in the shape of a ring. So I'm gonna do gold instead of silver hopefully. So yeah, I'm gonna try them now, I'm a bit nervous. These are absolutely criminal, but I'll fix it tomorrow. This delivery came today from So Sue. It's a new CC Me In Foundation. I'm really excited. I heard this was great, and I've seen lots of people use it, and it looks so good. So, they sent three shades. So, I'm sure they'll probably all suit me, to be honest, for different stages of tan <laughs> like that's tan that's like medium kind of like chill tan and that's no tan so perfect anyway i'll let you know how i get on this is what it looks like inside there hey packing up all our stuff you <laughs> hey guys good morning so it's now saturday the day of the party i've got my teeth whitening strips in just need to say that first of all in case you're like what the hell's wrong with her she's not able to speak anymore but um yeah i've got them in i'm only out for half an hour with the dogs to get them out and because i feel bad they probably won't really get out today um and yeah also for me because i, I can't function without exercise like i feel like crap if i haven't i don't not even like crap i just feel stressed i'm already stressed and i haven't done anything even got out for a little bit I feel like worse, you know, that kind of way. So yeah, I'm gonna put purple shampoo on my hair because it really needs it. Um, don't worry. And yeah, wash that and stuff like that. Style that, and then I think I'll just bring my with me. I'm not sure. I haven't booked into anywhere. It's like flown in. The rake up, obviously, I can't book into like a person. Kind of in i'm like half packed up con's packing up some more stuff now and then i'll be ready to go so then we'll go up um, and decorate the room and stuff so i'll bring you along for that i have my camera charging at home at the moment so i'm on my phone also can't remember if i told you but i made sorry i'm sure you there one million we i made a spotify playlist so I'll link that below in case you want it. So I can make some new and old songs. Ugh, now I'm getting day to be able to tell them that. <laughs> just in case, I just keep panicking. Like, oh, have I told this? Oh, no, have I told them that? Oh, there is yours to know, aren't you? Oh, no. So I forgot to show you guys, but my tan is so good, so dark. I'll show you my leg now. Now, I do, I've washed it off. So I put it on, not last night, the night before, and washed it off and this is pretty much that color like i put on a bit of gradual um 
yesterday then after that i haven't washed that off yet but that's pretty much it so i also if you you know how like when you're sleeping a few bits come off so i have to like redo a few bits but i didn't do a whole new layer or anything i just put on some uh gradual moisturizer and i'm gonna have a shower now and then just put normal moisturizer on um so yeah i used the be Bell ultra dark this is so old as well like i've had this bottle for ages but it was the only ultra dark that i could find even though i'm sure i had other ones um and I also knew it was really dark because I've used it before, but like I probably used it well over a year ago. Like it's nearly all gone. Um, but it was still perfect. Like it came up really, really well. I'm so dark, like. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have a share. And obviously, like I've washed my hands loads of times as well. So it's come off them and I didn't do much on them because you know they always go really dark. So <laughs> I didn't want to overdo it. Um so yeah, that is 10 out of 10 would recommend. Um, and then I also live for this gradual moisturizer from Bella Miata. You already know that. <laughs> I use it all the time. Um, it's so good. It just kind of like locks the tan in, like gets it all to blend together. It's just really nice. Um, so yeah, I would recommend that doing that like the day before and then that the day before or the day after that. Um, and yeah, then I'll have a shower now. Hopefully I won't smell too bad of tan because I put this on a few days ago now. So yeah. Ready to go up and decorate for the party. Central. Wait, here's my nails in daylight. Ooh, we have to set everything up. Yeah, yeah, we'll make it up anyway. We need to ask for a knife to do it. The hardest. so much <laughs> took ages to decorate but it looks good i think i'll actually curl my hair first i need to get this water into me first i'm so thirsty i'm boiling it was so warm up in the function room the worst part about having a party where it's like i can be on time i need to get that early realistically and it's just not for me
guys my camera died and i have my flash on now so like to do my makeup but i'm ready to go actually yeah, my camera didn't die it ran out of memory so i need to delete stuff and i didn't have time to film the rest of myself getting ready because i'm in a bit of a rush but i'm gonna get my dress and stuff on now so i'll hopefully remember to get a video showing you everything <laughs> Yeah. I'm exhausted. I'll put this in the back. I need to go home and clean the room. Last night was so good though, wasn't it? So good. And I moved everything back around. To put in the balloons. Oh, we have to get the stuff now. This dress, but there's actually not much at all. Yeah, and we're getting a McDonald's anyway. If has gone to get us a McDonald's. So. We need to be quick because our McDonald's will be there when we go home. That was actually so grand. We were so quick. So fine. And they're only just at McDonald's. I cannot wait. I'm going to try the Chicken Big Mac, but my friend uh, Eva just sent me an article that she saw that they don't have it on the menu at the moment anymore. I don't know why. But anyway, maybe they will. Maybe they won't. Raging, but I'll just get a normal one anyway. Anyway, I'll just get a normal one anyway. If not, to wash my hair and everything last night was so good i was dancing so much my hair is literally wet so i had to wash it today i was like Ugh. i felt so gross but anyways can't wait nothing that a delicious coke zero and big mac meal won't fix <laughs> the bastards didn't have a chicken big mac and they gave we both got the big mac then so they gave us chicken nuggets instead so mean comments but fucking bastards were fuming Con's gone outside to look, like load up the car on there. Just peeking on him. <laughs> hey, where is he? Where is he gone, puppy? How dare he? You very concerned? Go home now. I'm cold and using the coat as a blanket. I'm just cold and tired. Uh oh. Okay guys, we're home now and unpacking and stuff like that. So I'm going to end the video here. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I'm sure it was so on over the place. So I hope you did enjoy it. Um, anyway, I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.